man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Yes, it was. What? You were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. You're back. What happened? Nothing. Lee took care of it. Yes, I did. I did take care of it. Don't you worry about it. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What? Well, they're having an argument again? What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Oh, what? Um, uh, the, 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 the... I don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all did a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. That bitch is shredding and mowing Larry. Think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Those are my children, Nick. Those are my children you. carriers. And thank she doesn't you threaten stringing them up on the tree. The That's just nasty. Born with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Ugh. Whatever. Now can I go look in the barn? I bet you Sophia's in there. Or not. Here, I'll give that to her. So I just put it in my back pocket. Alright. That sounds good. I'm gonna just open that up. Hmm. Walk extremely slowly. And now open it. There you go. I want to go to the barn and open that. Okay, that's a creaky barn door. Duck, you better not kill that cow too. It's Don't okay, buck. Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. It's getting dark out there. It's almost time for Din Din. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. Ah, that's we'll see. Zombie baby that. cow. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck? That is nasty. Why would you lick the salt lake? Hey there, Andy. Yeah? Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Yeah, that's a retarded ass face. Thanks. Yep. Oh, I'll have to tell him number two. Yeah, damn it. No, I'll talk hey to you there, again. Andy. Yeah. There we go. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Now exit. I want to talk Thanks. about this cow. Yep. Okay. Clementine. How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. I want it. Uh, there we go. Pat. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! Yes, I did. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I haven't thought about it in a while. I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Hey there, Andy. Oh, I don't want to talk to him yeah. again. No, get out of here. Thanks. Yep. Alright. This door. Anything in there? Nope, just a feeding job thing. 
That's it. Back. Okay. That's. No, the salt lake and the feeding shop. And uh, hey, that. Nope. Back. Nothing in there. About that one. Ah, a lot of boxes. Uh, look at the box. Is there anything in there I should know about? Empty. Wow, you didn't even stick your hand in there. You just like touched it. Get out of there. <sighs> this stall? Anything? Good? Yes? Okay. Another salt lake and another feeding stuff and a bunch of junk. Can I look at a bunch of junk? Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Hmm. Back. It smells like shit. Uh, there we go. Uh, just another cream shop. And one belt. Yeah! Open door. Just another feeding shop too. Get that. What about? Can I talk to you? I don't want to talk to you. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. Okay. Hey about? there, Andy. Yeah. You sound really. How's the cow? Mad well, something. better now we got Doc on the case. Thanks. Yep. She lost a patient. I wouldn't trust her. I think there's nothing else in there. Um, get, get the, there we go. That now looks a lot brighter out here. And the door didn't even make a noise that time. <laughs> wow. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Just wow. Wow. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go interrupt their little flirt session. Interruption. Uh, open door. We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. I'm get the fuck out of here. <laughs> you been getting along with Larry? <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Yeah, let's just go with Don't hard. judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity here. No, he's just trying to flirt with you, old farts. Ah, uh, a little bit. How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Hmm. Uh, Sexism. Not to be rude, ma'am. How come you're out here instead of, you know? Oh, you want to know why I'm not slaving away in the kitchen? Is that it? Uh, no, no, I didn't mean for it to sound like that. Oh, it's okay, darling. Got it slow cooking in the oven. Should be ready before too long. Okay. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. That's so. Why did you make a deal with those people? We got a threat of humanity left, Lee. We can do more good without them in our hair by placating them. So that's what we do. Think I'll go have a look around. Kinda peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Oh, is that it? Okay. What's it, um, yeah. is that still on? Why are you going all the way around to look at that? No, but what are you doing? Whatever. Uh, 
generator. Is that still running? Can I look at that? I'm glad Andy knows how to fix this if something goes wrong. I'm clueless about this All stuff. Right. Well then. Open gate. Larry, I don't want to talk to you. So, uh, uh, just, just go up there. Just talk to her. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy with a crossbow pointed right at my head. So I had to kill her. Jesus Christ! Did you at least get some goddamn food? No, nothing. I knew it. It was a mistake coming here. Huh. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding They are hiding, hiding something, something. goddammit. I agree but with you. You told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Uh, I love that. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in no, his he shoulder. Wouldn't have. 